press to start um, opening this one. We need actually you just need three things. So we need uh, your reliable screw set. So I'm using shall we show me we have that beauty right there. Then you may need pliers to pull the knobs out if in case you're having problems um, or you're having a hard time pulling it out and you may need a piece of cloth or a tissue just so that you can cover it while pulling it so that you don't damage the knobs. So to get started we're gonna get a bring out the screws and select this one. So we're gonna use a Phillips Zero. So you don't need to remove the mic from here yet but this will come handy just so that something can hold it. So there's, there's gonna be three screws that you're gonna be removing. This two right here and another one is behind this rubber. So we're gonna try to zoom in a bit. So we're gonna be removing this, this and one behind this rubber. So you can easily do this right here. So I need to keep the screw so good thing my Xiaomi Wii uh, has a magnetic case so the screws can stay there. So now all you gotta do is to yank this rubber off. I'm gonna use I replace my screw head with this one. I'm not sure what this is called. Yep, this like prong makes it easier to peel out this rubber Wait. there see it's easier to pull it out then I'm gonna replace the screw head again Now everything should be pretty loose, so the first thing we're going to do is to let's try to remove this, so give us more leverage. It's actually, oops, the base is actually not attached to the board itself, so it may stay if you feel like you would need something to hold the mic while you're removing it, but for now we're going to try to remove it. So for this one, you try to remove this. Right. See, that's what I mean. It's gonna take time to remove this one. So I'm gonna cover this with a tissue. Then I'm gonna use this part of the pliers to hold this one and yank the knob off just so we don't damage it see make it easier and let's see okay should we oh yep we damaged it a bit I actually held it the wrong side but not too bad now this one this one should actually yep can remove it need to be careful this is the thing there's it's pretty um, now for this one, I actually can't grip it really hard. don't want to damage so you can actually use the buyers but for now we're not opting not to use it okay. 
yeah, you see, you may damage the knobs using that. Alright, that's all. Two thousand years later. So if, it's gonna take some time to remove these knobs. Had to wrestle it behind the scenes. I actually used the pliers too, and as I said, if you're gonna use the pliers, it's gonna damage the knobs right there. But uh, it's not a problem, it should not be a problem, it's just cosmetics, we can easily replace that, we can easily buy spare parts. So, once air, the knob, the three screws are removed, and we can easily remove this one. So I actually forgot why I um, needed to open this one. Um, I'm actually having issues. This is actually a known issue on the Blue Yetis, where if you see that there's a small bit of copper out, so there's actually an issue with um, the USB ports on Blue Yetis. So I still don't have the spare parts yet, but I'm gonna buy a spare part for this one, a USB port. So I just wanted to show you how to open this one. I just wanted to practice how to open this one in case I already have the part with me. So in case I may have the part and we could all continue the video with repairing this Blue Yeti. But for now, I'm just showing you how to open the Blue Yeti so that you can attempt to repair yourself. And also to show you what's inside the Blue Yeti. So these are the boards. And in order for you to see the, the mic itself here, remove this four screws and there's actually um, three mics inside this one like three membranes on this one so there you have it so to replace this one the USB port you just need to desolder this one remove it and solder the USB back so there you have it that's how you open Blue Yeti and in case I may have the spare part the spare USB part I will continue with a video from fixing this Blue Yeti and see you on the next video. Peace.